Hello and welcome, DJ Vic Vapor with you. Bitwig Studio 2, and not really a tutorial today, just taking the time to show you guys some presets that I've created. Uh, I've got a pack of presets for the transition map. That These presets were created in Bitwig Studio 2, so I'm not certain that even if you have the transition map in Bitwig Studio 1, I can't guarantee that the presets will work in Bitwig Studio 1. They may, but I'm just letting you know up front I created everything in Bitwig Studio 2 so for uh, compatibility sake if and when you do purchase Bitwig Studio 2 here in the next week or so when it comes out on the 28th uh, feel free to grab my presets so let me take a look and show you what I got going on the transposition map as you already know if you have Bitwig Studio when you open it there aren't any presets unless you've created some and saved them I've taken the time to put together 57 different scale types and you can see it update over here as I click and select different ones. But the, I've got a total of 57 different scale types in here. And it allows for, you know, quick and easy access to um, working with your MIDI files and your notes. So that is my transposition maps presets, 57 of them. And multi-note is new to Bitwig Studio 2. And it, it is well when you first open it up and get it you'll see that you don't have any presets, there's nothing saved. But I've um, taken the time to put together 37 different chord structures here, different chord types. You can see those update as I select different ones here. So there's different chords for you to grab and you know just browse through and change your uh, chord structures. So let's take a listen. I'm going to cancel that. Let's take a listen to what we've got. I got, you can see here in the MIDI clip, I'll open it up for you. Just some basic notes, one note, one or, you know, one or two. There's no chord structures, nothing there. It's just kind of straightforward note. And then I've got uh, a synth loaded. So let's take a listen to how, how it sounds before we add any kind of chord or transposition structures to it. So pretty straightforward and now with multi-note let's take a listen and one of my chords here uh, let's see which one we have this is the suspended second so big difference right away you can hear that now what if I'm going to turn off the multi-note for a second the transposition map is currently we're looking at the major pentatonic scale so let's hear what it does just with that. Pretty cool. So together, what do we get? So big difference from where we started, which was to this. And as I said, each um, device here comes with its own preset pack that I've created. And to show you where you can get that, let's go to my Patreon page. So if you haven't visited my Patreon page, feel free to do so. I've got a couple patrons, but the page is new, so progress to be made, I guess they say. But if you come in here and you kind of scroll down, you'll see that I've got a total of 87 patron only posts which mean there are 87 tutorials not currently on YouTube that are specific to this page and it covers everything from Ableton Live, Bitwig Studio, Bitwig Studio 2, my whole course for Bitwig Studio 2 um, is all here on my Patreon page, Logic Pro 10 and I've got some Max for Live um, tutorials as well and again all these are specific to my Patreon page so I've got quite a you know a lot of material here and simply you know like like my page says just for one dollar members you're pretty much all these are accessible for just a dollar a month I mean it doesn't I can't lower it any cheaper than that and make it any easier however when it comes to my um, presets and my different templates and things that I'm going to be releasing that is simply just five dollars so it's a five dollar donation and it'll give you both of these preset packs, not $5 each. It's $5 gets everything. 
not only do you get the presets for five bucks, but you get all these other access to all these other tutorials as well. So kind of open up Pandora's box. So if you've got a couple extra minutes, jump over here to my Patreon page. I'll have a link in the description below and you can kind of scroll through and see what's going on and what's available to you. I'd really appreciate the support. It means a lot. Put a lot of hours and time into all my tutorials and my different presets. So, and I do it kind of to share the love of music. So I'm not trying to be the next millionaire. So just, um, you know, help every little bit helps. I guess they say it keeps the coffee flowing so I can stay up and keep pumping out the tutorials. Thanks for uh, pushing play. Thanks for hanging out as always and peace. We'll see you soon.